What's up guys? I don't know if you can tell, it's the end of the night, I'm a little tired, but today's episode is pretty awesome. It's short, quick, and at the end of the episode, I'm gonna give you guys a little few of the things that, I don't know, that I've learned throughout the day. Oliver, what do you think, buddy? Oh yeah, let's get to the episode. Number one, it is another day. I think this is episode five of the next five years. A little slow starts my morning. Uh, punched that alarm back about five more minutes than usual, so I have five more minutes of sleep. Woke up very tired. Not like you, you know, usually I wake up and I'm like ready. But now, I'm ready and good to go. So let's get this day started. What's up guys, so I'm taking a little bit of a break real quick from being in front of the computer. Got Harley back here using the restroom. Sending out some emails today, some really important ones that uh, I'll highlight in the future, probably not today, um, just because it's uh, some important business stuff. And um, other than that, finding some ways to procrastinate, uh, not getting some things done that I should be getting done. And then also, here's what happens, and maybe some of you guys experience this too. Look at the dogs like freaking out, watch. Oh my God, yeah, she's got has like the zoomies. Uh, maybe you experience this too, but you kind of find yourself sometimes having these moments where you're not really sure what to do and you're like, what am I supposed to be doing right now? Uh, definitely something that I experience often. Uh, it's like, should I be doing something different right now? Should I be doing this or should I be doing that? And I think it's just understanding that um, be doing, be creating, be thinking about ideas, whether it's business or life in general. Um, you know, don't let yourself just sit and do nothing. Just discover something, get into something and, and uh, practice it and test it out. And I think that's the best way to grow. So another part of my life too, guys, is being an uncle. Right now I'm at my niece and nephew's school, picking them up. This is always fun. What's up, man? You doing right? You guys show me where the where your sisters get picked up. Gabby's, I think picking up Emma's all the way over there. Okay, let's. All right, guys. So we are taking off back to work, and Courtney probably can't get the dog in the back. Let's see it, Court. Let's, let's see that dog. Oh, you got lucky that time. I know you've been shouting up for a while. <laughs> Headed off to the gym, guys. We'll take you there in just a second. Pro tip, guys. Pre-make your food. And this rice they have over at HEB over here, which is our grocery store. Uh, don't mind the trash right there, all right? Um, just great to get a little bit extra calories and carbohydrates in. And we're on the move! Six PM crew. Court taking out the trash. Woo wee. There you go, all dope. All right guys, Coach David here. Just now leaving the gym for the evening. Check it out behind me. Got a little seven PM class going on right now. Coach Travis finishing out the evening for us awesome day of coaching and training again great energy from top to bottom a lot of work done today um, still some small things here and there that we have to get done on that sheet of goals of task to do but you know what chipping away one day at a time guys it's the way you do business sometimes sometimes you got to put your put your foot down pedal to the metal type and sometimes you just got to chip away same thing in life some things you want you just got to go full throttle. Other things that you want, you got to be patient. Chip away, chip away, chip away. Let's get it. <laughs> 